<laughs> you got you got a video like this. All right, guys, we're here in Philly to the Comic Con, and we're in this little tiny ass elevator. Look at this. Oh, God. It's like we're three, barely. It's like a, it's like worse than a closet. <laughs> oh my God, I can barely fit in here. Look at this. Look, he's hitting the roof over here. Oh my God. <laughs> oh shit. Oh my God. Great, thank you. That is awesome. Thanks, bro. We're here in the convention hall in Philadelphia, and I guess we gotta buy the tickets. It's empty, because it is Friday. And these are some of the people that are gonna be here. We got William Shatner. Uh, who else do we have? Stan CM Lee. Punk. Stan Lee's gonna be there. Where we gotta go? All the way down? Bag, so we're entering the hall. Philadelphia Comic Con. Oh, what's that? Look, look. The Red Skull. The Red Skull. I guess we're gonna start seeing some weird shit in here. So get ready, guys. There you go. <laughs> Back to the future car. The DeLorean. I, I gotta say, that's one fat ass Iron Man. <laughs> alright, Doug. Alright, Mikey. This is The Walking Dead. And these are signed by all five. I want to get this, but. It's for like 2.95, dude. So we're gonna pass on that. Some things over here we're spotting. Elizabeth Shannon. We already know that you're gonna want. We got DDP in the house. That's Diamond Dallas Page. Jimmy Hart. Ted DiBiase, the million dollar man. Lou Ferrigno, guys. Yep, that's the original Incredible Hulk right there. Alright, Jay's getting his uh, picture taken with Lou Ferrigno. Some toys and it looks pretty cool. Look at the Hulk, got bullet holes. It's Captain America. These are badass. Check out that Spider Man costume, Poison Ivy. <laughs> What's up, there, guys? I just wanted to show you guys exactly what I picked up at Comic Con. This was the first Comic Con that I went to, so I'm kind of saving everything here. As you guys can see, I went on Friday. This was just the wrist strap that they gave out, so I'm holding on to that. And if you guys know that I'm a huge fan of Incredible Hulk, so I did get a chance to meet Mr. Lou Ferrigno, and he was the first Incredible Hulk, and he did sign that for me. And I also took a Polaroid picture with him as well, and he also signed that too. So since I am a huge Incredible Hulk fan, I just had to go meet him. And, uh, and I was also able to pick up the Incredible Hulk uh, glass, which uh, for me to collect. So I did have that. And as many of you know that I also like to collect a lot of comic stuff and everything. So I wanted to go ahead and pick this up. And this is actually pretty nice. As soon as I saw it, I had to pick this up. Now this is the Batman knife. And 
And I just had to pick this up as soon as I saw this, guys. Look at that. That is pretty sweet. And I just had to pick it up. Now, one big thing that actually sold me on this was... Now, you guys heard about Chinese stars. Well, Batman has his own stars as well. And this is actually in the knife itself. So let me go ahead and take this out. Show you exactly how it is. And there we go. And these are kind of like the Batman Ninja Stars and stuff. So that's pretty cool. And there are two of them. There's one on this side and one here. And they are pretty sharp, guys. And then you just go ahead and put them back in here. And it just and then it just stays on just like that. So it's got a nice little grip right here. And I'm actually going to use these for my unboxing uh, videos. So that's pretty cool. I just had to get this. And the next is these are a couple of things that I picked up. And this is actually what I picked up. And this is one of my boy that picked up. I just had to show it to you guys because I just thought it looks pretty cool. And this is very interesting. So let me move these out of the way just so I can show you once I open this up. So just to show I can show you, I had to move this camera around a little bit just so you guys can get a good view. And I just had to pick this up, guys. And I just thought this was pretty unique where one of this artists actually drew this. And he actually drew this with a number two pencil. And look at that. That's pretty awesome. This was all done by number two pencil. Yes, everything was done by it except for the color, which is his eyes. That was the only one that was not done with the number two pencil. But everything else with details and everything was done with number two pencil. So I just had to pick this up. Okay, now this other one that I'm going to show you guys uh, is my boy that he picked up because he is a huge fan of Iron Man. Now this was done by the same artist as the Incredible Hulk. And this was all done by a number two pencil as well. Except for the colors that you see on here, which was not too much. And like I said, it's pretty awesome, guys. So these are some of the things that I picked up from Comic-Con 2012.